other sectors or other semiconductor companies that you like? Yeah. So I guess I would preface all this and just say, get comfortable with semiconductors. Um, they are uh, 50% of the AI market. That's up from 20 to 30% of the mobile market. And they will be, for us, uh, the right way to participate in AI in the near term. Um, we had like 45% allocation going into 2023 to AI. I want to say 40% of that was semiconductors. Um, and the other thing that I guess if there's anything you get out of this conversation today, uh, it's that the semiconductors are going to become the AI software players. Uh, already, uh, NVIDIA, the biggest announcements this past week, in my opinion, are the Omniverse Cloud APIs. Um, Apple is now partnering with NVIDIA on Omniverse for Vision Pro headsets. Like, since when does Apple partner with somebody on software? Um, to attract developers, like this is a big, this is a, if, 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 if you know, like Apple's history with developers and they're now uh, going to leverage NVIDIA to make sure that they have enough development for that device. It's like, whoa, this is a big moment. Um, and it, this is across the board that NVIDIA not only has had uh, the opportunity to have these GPUs uh, pre-launch, of course, it's their GPUs. Um, but they're also just the closest to the problems that need to be solved. So they're building software uh, rapidly to uh, facilitate renting of GPUs in the cloud, uh, to facilitate better development across the board for AI. 